These buses are all ready to start carrying Helena Public Schools students when classes begin next week. But some of them may not be running right away, as the bus operator is dealing with a significant shortage of drivers. Yeah, I think in 20 years, this is probably the most drivers we've been down at the beginning of the year. The district's goal was to have 72 drivers. Their bus contractor, First Student, reported last week that they were about 20 short of that. First Student has brought in temporary employees to cover some of the openings, and the district is making a plan to combine some routes. We'll be running essentially two different routes with one bus, which complicates the transportation and the fact that some kids will be getting up uh, considerably early to catch the first tier of the route and then there will be a second tier. The most likely routes to combine are shorter ones around the city and those with fewer students expected to use them. In addition to daily bus routes, the shortage could affect travel to sports and other extracurricular activities. School districts across the country are reporting bus driver shortages. In Helena, First Student held recruitment events earlier this summer, giving people a chance to try maneuvering a school bus. They're now offering sign-on bonuses of several thousand dollars to new drivers. Leaders are particularly looking for candidates with a commercial driver's license. They will help people without a CDL get the necessary training, but it will take longer for them to be ready to take on a route. If you're interested in applying, you can find more information on our website. The district hopes people in the community will step up to help fill this gap. We're in need of drivers and we're looking at trying to help our kids have an opportunity to get to school in a fashion they did a year and a half ago. The Helena School District plans to let parents know about any changes to their kids' routes by the end of the day Wednesday. In Helena, Jonathan Amberian, MTN News.